Trick or treat, it's Halloween and I'm dead. Yes, I'm going to hand out candy like this. Um, I hung myself and somehow uh, the rope broke or someone cut me down. But either way, I got a gnarly looking neck, get bruised up and the rope rubbed off of the skin. So it's fleshy and bloody and gross, just the way I like it. So if you wanna see how I made this dead person, dead girl, dead neck look, stay tuned and I will show you how. Okay, first things first, I'm gonna split my neck. So I'm taking my um, liquid latex and yeah, I ended up buying like the freaking huge thing of it. Um, you don't have to buy such a big um, container of it. They have them a lot smaller, way more affordable if you're just gonna do one makeup look. But I've been doing a lot of latex looks just because I love it and I love the way it dries and it's actually really comfortable on my skin it doesn't bother me like how sometimes you know um silicone or whatever can just be or if you put like other kinds of looks like glue even glue isn't as good i just the cheaper ways they always say to create this look isn't always better latex i think is the way to go so latex toilet paper my little cup and a sponge, and I'm just gonna create the slit across my neck. sticky and it'll stick together and if you move your neck then it'll stick in the creases. So I just take this translucent powder and a little puffy pad poof, and uh, powder. I, the reason I don't use a brush is just because I don't want the latex if there is any wet, wet pieces sticking to my brush. If you have a brush you don't really care about it doesn't really matter but I just want this to be so it doesn't stick to it itself. So make sure you powder really well. You can just use, it doesn't have to be translucent powder either, it can be just a powder that you use every day uh, for your face. So now I'm just going to create the slit and I'm just going to go where my natural neck fold is and then So you're just gonna rip. And cut. Be real careful about cutting around your neck though. doesn't really look like a clean cut slit throw. It looks like it was really hacked off at the neck or um, just like something was strangling me and then like ripped the skin around it. So I decided that I'm going to do like a noose and then um, basically like the noose really ruined my neck. 
and so this is going to be bruised and then bloody on the inside because I am dead so the noose did work so I'm just going to take these two palettes you can use um, cream eyeshadows in the bruise kind of colors and then I have this Ben Nye Death Will but once again you can just use um, all these kind of colors in cream eyeshadows if you don't um, have like a costume supply by you or you don't want to order these kind of things online. around the wound and then it just, it bruised. 